Kelly and welcome back to our channel. For today's video, I'm doing a huge thrift haul. I went thrifting today and I swear I found some amazing things. First off, I want to apologize for the little rings in my eyes. I got like a ring light and I love it, but I have glasses. So I'm gonna have to figure that out. I might start wearing like my contacts again just while I'm filming like sit down videos just so I can use it. This is also gonna be a try on thrift haul. So after I show you each product, there'll be like a little clip of me trying it on. So the first thing I just wanna say, I spent $110 today, which seems like a lot, but for everything that I show will show you, not bad at all. So the first thing I got is this little picture. It's the almost only home decor thing I got. But I got this because we're gonna make like a little shelf to go above our dining room table. And I figured like this would be cute, maybe with like some fake plants in it or like stacked on top of books. This next thing I got is so, so big and kind of really hard to show. But I got this like wooden rocking chair. It's really a little kid. It's so, so cute. It was only $9.99, which I don't think is really that bad because it's like a substantial piece of furniture but we put Finny in it. I'll put like a picture that I posted on my Instagram and I swear he's so so cute in it. Next thing I got is a little purse. I am so happy that I found this because this was my favorite purse. Brenda got me it for my 22nd birthday and it like ripped. It's from Universal Threads from Target and these straps ripped off after like a year of use. And like I got rid of it because I was like, I don't wanna use like a ripped handbag. This is in like perfect condition. I like don't think anyone has ever used it because like there's, it doesn't look used at all. It was only $4. And I mean like normally this purse is like 30 bucks, but um, like they just didn't have it when I like ruined it. So I am so happy about this. Next thing I got is a little scarf. It's like plaid. Um, I don't really wear scarves anymore, but I really, really liked this cause it's like a huge scarf. It's like a blanket scarf. And I just thought it was so cute. And I'm gonna like throw it in the wash obviously because it's used, but I thought it was so cute. And I'm really trying to like reiterate my um, wardrobe. I really like neutral colors. Next, I found one thing for my husband. I got him these shorts. Sorry, I'm buttoning them. They have brand new tags on them and he doesn't really have any shorts. So I figured I'd get him these. I really liked them. They're golf shorts, but um, he doesn't golf. So we'll just wear them all the time. He's from, it's from this brand. I have never heard of it, but it really has brand new tags. They're originally $30. So Next, I got three things for my son, or I guess four things with the chair. I got him this little champion sweatshirt. I thought this was so cute. I really, like, I'm not into brands on clothing, but I still, like, really liked that. Then I got him this little jacket. It's originally from Old Navy. I really like Old Navy, so I'm not mad about that. But it's just this little, like, windbreaker type of thing. Um, the inside is gray. He's not really a big hood wearer, so I don't know how much he's gonna like this, but I figured it was cute. And I got him these, and he, I like don't buy him baby shoes because like, he's not wearing them. But look at these cute little vans. Like they're actually by van. And like, they're just so cute. He wore them in the same picture that um, he was in the chair, so. Yeah, I'm not gonna post it again because it's like, you can barely see them, but they're so, so cute. They're like his size right now, which is a four, like an infant four, which feels like so big for like a seven month old, but I think they're so cute. But these were $9. I don't know if I would have bought them if I knew they were $9, but still like $9 instead of however much they are new, like, all right. Okay, so now I'm gonna get into my clothes. I found a lot of clothes today, so there's gonna be a big try on. So the first thing I found is this little vest. It is like one of those, this is actually a perfect way to show it. It drapes out to the front and it's just so cute. And it does not feel like it was ever worn. Like it's like super, super plushy still. And it looks really dark and dirty, but like it's actually just like the lighting in my room because this room is so, so dark. But I love it, it's so cute. I love the tan because I'm like a big tan girl now. Okay, so this is over the brown top. I don't know if I like, showed this yet. I'm doing like try on afterwards, but I love this. 
I feel like such a bad bee in this. It's just like, like you can't hurt me. Like I am, I'm cute. I just love this. I think this is like so cute. I'm pretty positive I saved something like this on Shein. And I was like, I can't do a vest. I can't do a vest. I can do a vest. I love this. This is so cute. This is so me. I'm so happy. Next, this is like so far out of my comfort zone, but I tried it on and it was so, so comfortable. It is this like green romper. It's like a hunter green, I guess. And it has like cinched in the waist and then it has pockets and then it goes down to like a cuff. Um, I tried this on and it almost looks pajama-y, but then I put like this um, shacket over top and I'll do that for the try on because I feel like that's the only way that it's not gonna look like pajamas. But um, I really, really liked it and it was so, so cheap. This is the jumpsuit. I feel like it's looking black on camera. I don't know why. I think it kind of looks like pajamas um it is super super comfortable so it honestly might be pajamas i don't know how i feel about it with the jacket because it's like green i know it looks black but um it's still really comfortable like i will definitely be wearing this because this is comfortable even if i'm just wearing it in the house like i feel super super comfortable on this next thing i got is from the brand vintage vintage Susie. It is this brown, it looks black on the camera. I'm really sorry about the lighting. But it's like this brown, like, the only way that I can like explain this material is that it's like, it's not like a bathing suit, but it's like a bathing suit. Or um, like a body suit, I guess. Like one of those really stretchy body suits, but it's a shirt. So like you can wear it and it's tight like a body suit, but it like doesn't have the crotch issue. So then we have the brown long sleeve like kind of like a bodysuit i tucked it in like a bodysuit i love this i think that this is so cute um i just love how it fits i feel like it's very flattering i'm kind of liking the whole like tightness like it really helps like support my stomach um which is like a very insecure part of my body but um i really really like this i have no complaints other than um i wish it was like a little bit longer just because i do feel like it's going to pop out a little bit it is definitely like a cropped top but speaking of bodysuits i did buy one this is like a green tank top bodysuit um i tried this on like over my clothes so that way like i can see if like it fits and it does so I really liked this and I really like this green color so I had to get this. So the next thing is the green bodysuit. I really like it. It is not tucked in or it is not buttoned. It is just tucked into my pants so it might be a little frumpy but um, I really really like it. I think that it's super super me. I like the shade. It's really really stretchy. I feel like it's pretty forgiving too. Like I, I am not skinny so this is like I like this. I like this a lot. I think it would be even cuter with like a cardigan or just anything. I'm trying to like be a little bit more risky with the way things that I wear because I don't love my body right now, but I love fashion. So I feel like I just need to wear it anyway. Like who's going to care? I don't care. I like this. This shirt could not be any more me. This is like a black like short sleeve peplum top um i don't care if these ever go out of style this is what i will be buried in because a peplum top is like it's me this is from rue 21 originally Next, i have this little black peplum i really really like this this is so me um i'm literally going to throw all these clothes in the wash so i can wear the shirt tomorrow i love it i just like i love it i love peplum tops with a little cardigan moment or a little shacket. I love this so much. Next, this was in the go back section when I was like trying on clothes. It's from the brand LA Hearts, which I feel like is from Nordstrom. I don't know. Um, no, maybe not Nordstrom. I don't think it's a very expensive brand, but it's this little like cropped sweater that has three buttons. I thought it was so cute with like my jeans. It's a medium slash large, so it makes me feel skinny. Really, it's just like really oversized. So um, yeah, I really like it. And I am trying to lose weight right now, so I think that it will be good like 
it'll be even better when I lose weight. Okay, so this is the little chunky sweater. I think that this is really, really cute. I like how it like cuts off right before my jeans. So it kind of like helps my figure. Um, obviously I think this will look a lot cuter once I lose weight, but I still like it right now. So that's all that matters. The next thing I got is this top. This is from Denim 24 seven. I think that that's what I thought was Fashion Nova, but it says Denim. Um, it is this white tank top with like this brown lace. Um, I tried this on and I didn't really like it until I tucked it into my jeans and then I was like put this jacket on I really liked it because like the like brown goes with like the brown jacket and I just like I think this is like a good staple like if we were ever to go like on a date like I could wear this for like a date night and be super cute and flirty okay next this is the white tank top with like the lace on top um, I really like it I feel like this like seam makes it look a little bit weird but I like it tucked in and then this is the jacket I was wearing I think that it looks really cute because it's like flirty fun but then the jacket kind of like helps it but yeah I really like this um, next this is also like one of those body suits but a tank top this is like a tannish pinky color which I really really like because it's like kind of like a nude it's a nude color so like I mean it's not my skin tone because I'm like white as a ghost but um it is like a skin tone and I think that it would be so cute like um tucked into jeans and then like a shacket or something um but yeah I really really like this and it's like a super cute basic okay so this is the like brown tight like almost bodysuit material tank top I really like this I think that this is so flattering I am definitely lucky out with this haul like this is one of the last tops I've tried on. I don't know when I showed this, but I love, love, love this. This is so cute. I think it would be even cuter with like a different tone of jeans maybe. Um, I don't know if the shacket goes. I feel like I'm like basing everything off of the shacket because I just want to wear it every day. Okay, I think that that actually goes. I think that this is cute. I like, okay. I think that this is... I think this is cute. Next, I got three denim things. First, I got these pair of jean shorts. I did not try these on, which might come back to haunt me. But um, these have brand new tags on them. And I figured, like, I have tried this, um, like, brand before. And it's actually was sold by Stitch Fix. But it's um, the 1822 denim brand. Um, but I figured these were cute and i have like absolutely no shorts but i also don't like short shorts so i figured that was good let me just say it feels really wrong to be wearing shorts right now when it's like the middle of winter but i like these they are definitely tight um they fit but they're just tight um i like them a lot i think they're the perfect length i am not a short shorts type of girl especially now having a kid like i don't want my butt hanging out um I like these. I'm definitely gonna keep them because like since I'm trying to lose weight, I think that these are like gonna be the perfect type of jean shorts for the summer. Next, I tried these on. These are like so much more comfortable than leggings. These are some jeans from, um, what brand is it? Old Navy. They're the Rockstar jeans and these are like super, super stretchy. They fit perfectly. Um, they're definitely like the type of material that shrinks because these are a size 22 and I am a size 18. I mean, like I'm not like that far off from the size, but I'm like a size 18 in old navy jeans. So yeah, these definitely are like more sh shrunk than their original size, but I really, really liked them. These are the most comfortable pair of jeans. Like I can do like anything I want. They literally feel like leggings. Honestly, they might be more comfortable than my leggings. <laughs> they are perfect. They got real pockets. Yep, the back too. I love these. These, these are gonna be my staple. Like, who cares about leggings anymore? These jeans. These jeans are where it's at. And then the last thing for my haul is these Lee Easy Fit jeans. I did not try these on but I figured that they were cute and I am again trying to lose weight so I feel like even if they don't fit 
um, they will fit eventually. Also, they have no size on them. Like, <laughs> I just realized. Um, but I still like them. So I got those. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we finally have a fail. These might look fine until I keep backing up and my whole ankles are out. Um, these are definitely not staying. Um, I like cannot think of a single place that I'd need to wear like high waters that are flared. Like if they were tight, I feel like they'd be cute, right? Maybe not, I don't know. These are definitely a no. But I like the fit and they're so comfortable, so kind of sad about this and that is everything that I got today I feel like I got a lot of stuff for $110 like I feel like I really hit the jackpot today I was feeling really bad at myself because yesterday we went shopping and I got a ton of stuff and like a lot of it fit but just like some of it didn't look good with my new like body after having a baby and like I'm just so happy with everything that I found today especially this purse like Target, thank you for making a purse that I absolutely love. It's not at all like the best quality because it's not real leather, but um, like still like you can't go wrong with a Target purse, you know? But that is everything that I have to show with you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you're subscribed and make sure you hit that little bell so you get notified anytime I post a video. I am trying to post at least twice a week. So I hope you guys enjoyed this week or this video today and I will see you guys next time. Bye guys.